Hey everyone, what is up? This is Aaron from the Pashto and thank you for joining me today. So basically, this is a quick unboxing video of the Justice League Bad Cow, licensed by DC Comics and distributed by us the Pashto. So over here, we will remove this uh, from the brown box, which you will re receive it in this manner. When you open it up, you will see the beautiful art box over here. So it's great, I love the art box. It's great design. Let's just turn it around. There you go. Open it up and we have it packaged right in there. So I'm gonna pull it right out. There's also a manual in the box over here. Nothing left. So the manual is pretty much our uh, own Chinese, but you can understand what's it like in the, in the pictures over here. So it's the time for opening the bed cow. Here you go. So gonna pull this right off it's really stunning I've seen this multiple times but again and again every time I look at it it's just wow so take a good look 360 view very nice close-up look the mold really came out well, um, so much better than the first time it was done. It's fantastic. You can remove the glasses, push up the glasses rather. Can't remove it entirely. And to remove it, it takes a lot of practice. It's actually pretty hard over here. And from the maker to actually change the acrylic stand into a model head over here um, for very good reason actually we noticed over months when it was displayed in the acrylic base uh, that the mask will be deformed and eventually actually looks pretty bad so we went with uh, the idea of using the model head however it did present a problem for us so when removing it it, was, it is actually very difficult I suggest if you're not going to wear it for cosplay or anything it is best not to remove it what I would do is actually to, when, when holding this, you would compress the mask inside so that it's actually, the ears are deformed a little bit. I push the head in so that it's easier to pull out. Bear in mind, this is something that you cannot slide out in one go. You have to be very gentle with it. Be careful of the glasses. One advice I would give to everyone would be, you see this over here? I would simply pull off one end and then reattach it later on by, by glue. Um, super glue actually so pull this out and it will just detach from here because it's hardened by glue and reattach it uh, with glue at the end after you remove the cow from the mask uh, from from the from the mannequin head so to pull it out you have to be very careful don't put your hands uh, in this sharper edges over here because what you do is you will actually tear right through the cow you're gonna have to grip it over here and then slowly very very gently pull it out, slide it out. I've done a couple of minutes of work over here so that it would slide out very easily. Here you go, this is the bat cow in its entirety, removed from it. But personally, I, I wouldn't remove it because it just becomes black. But yeah, um, again, caution to be very careful with the glasses. Where are the drugs going? No, actually. So, um, I have to tell everyone, when you're wearing the mask, please be have someone with you because this, this neck area is pretty tight. When I put it down, like my hair gets caught up in it and I'm like, oh shit, it's gonna tear off my hair. And um, yeah, I have a pretty much standard 24 inch head. It's, it's pretty tight fit over here. There's actually a couple of extra space, but Getting through the neck, it's really hard, and there's an area where you literally have to take a deep breath before 
slide it over your, your, your mouth and your nose or else you, you wouldn't be able to catch your breath so anyway, here, have a look I'm Batman so guys, um so guys sorry, I forgot about my voice when you're wearing it pull it down from the lock like so when you're removing it Hold it by the ears and pour it out. Like that. Take a deep breath and then slide it out. I'm Bruce Wayne. Well, I hope you liked uh, the short unboxing video I did. If you have any comments, send me a message uh, to the patch door. And thank you for your support, guys. Have a good one. Cheers.